What's going on everybody and welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. Who would have thought I'd get addicted to a hunting game? I can't believe it, but this has been fantastic to play for the last couple of days. Thank you guys so much for showing love to the series. Thank you for showing love to the channel. I do appreciate it. If you are new here, be sure to subscribe. And uh, without further ado, let's hop right into the game. Medved Taiga National Park. I downloaded yet another DLC for this game. There's a ton of DLC, ton of different reserves, uh, but this one seemed like a, a ton of fun. So we started off Leighton Lake District, uh, we were hunting deer and moose, Roosevelt elk, and then we moved on to the safari, we did some, some lions and things, and now it says, far from civilization and a challenge for hunters, adventurers, and scientists alike, the taiga, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, with its frozen valleys, mountains, and unreliable weather conditions will put your navigation and tracking skills to the test. Hunters looking for a variety of game will not be disappointed, as the Siberian mainland is home to solid populations of brown bear, moose, reindeer, I'm not shooting, bro, if I see a reindeer, I am not shooting that shit. I don't need that on my conscience. Lynx and the curious musk deer. So this seems fun. We're going to be in a Siberian winterland. So let's, uh, let's hop into it. I don't know what type of weapons and things we need, but I think with the 243 and the 30-06 that we got, that's pretty much good for anything we'll run into. Hello? Welcome to Medvedetaiga National Park, my Close friend. Close enough. Not that we are friends, yet. I am Hada Alena Hasavovna, but you can call me Alena. I'm your primary contact, so you and I will be friends in no time. Okay. I put together this cross-disciplinary expedition to study the effects of climate change in this region. My team and I are scientists not activists, so this isn't a political thing. We are only interested in data, verifiable facts. Okay, got that. That said, the taiga is not the most hospitable place. Gathering data and assessing the animal population here is difficult enough in spring and summer, but in winter it becomes dangerous. Not just for us, but for the local wildlife. <laughs> you in. The professional. You have a reputation for being a humane but effective hunter. Correct. My kind of hunter, I hope. Before we get down to the nitty gritty business, I can hear your stomach rumbling all the way here at base camp. Start by getting yourself some protein. Well, I have hunted many deer, or at least I used to hunt them near your location. Look around for tracks. They should be plentiful. If you're going to rest tonight, you need to find an outpost, and that means knowing where one is. You can only see so much from the ground, so unless you brought your rocket boots, you have to climb the nearest lookout point. I've marked the location on your hunter mate. Happy hiking! Okay, appreciate it. Dude, I didn't mean to shoot that deer with the 30-06, because obviously that's uh, not the right type of ammo. <laughs> to use. I meant to use the 243. I just forgot which slot it was in. <clears throat> okay, here we go though. What do we need to do? Locate, visit a lookout point. I don't think I really <laughs> located any tracks yet. Bro, brown bears? Aren't those the ones that will fuck you up? I'm almost certain that those are not nice. I'm getting like different colors in uh in this DLC. Purple poop. Green tracks. Everything was just white. And the other ones. Look at this scenery though. This is something else. I think it's the audio of this game that I really like. The scenery too, but the audio. Like the sound of my feet stepping on that snow. Just it sounds Sounds real. Sounds nice. Should I just sprint? I feel like maybe we should. Should I take a look at the map here? The Za- okay. The Zabia lands. Oh, this map's big as hell. Got a big river? I don't know what that is, but I'd love to go see it. I'm just gonna- We're gonna sprint. We got moose trotting. 
gotta find an outpost and see if maybe we need some different calls or something. I don't know. So if I see that brown bear, it's not gonna be pretty. I might have to take the shotgun to it straight up. I haven't even shot this thing yet. I don't know what to shoot with it. I'd have to be close as hell to something. Okay, here's our lookout tower though. Is this considered an outpost? I don't think so. Not even gonna attempt to pronounce that, whatever that is. <clears throat> okay, I made it. You want me to go to the top? They probably want me to go to the top. Let's go up there and at least see what we can find. Maybe we'll be able to see like the whole map. Dude, my guy is either tired or I'm carrying too much shit. I'm not sure which one it is. Here we go though, to the top. Oh shit, I'm up, baby. Survey. Lookout point unlocked, okay. Got 100 XP for that. Fantastic, oh. Okay, we got a bunch of spots. This lookout offers quite the view. From up here, you can see outposts, hunting grounds, yep. and all the nature you can feast your eyes on. I see that. thousand dollars cash okay so that's where we need to go the nearest outpost right. location is marked on your hunter mate which one go there now to rest resupply and take shelter that's you the one i was about to go to place it hasn't seen much use since winter came just making sure there's no bears in between here and there doesn't really look like it Unfortunately, I can't call my ATV. So I guess we're going to run over here to the outpost. Found some more poop. Who pooped this poop? Oh my god, it was a brown bear. <laughs> oh no. Okay. <clears throat> like, I just... I, I know the black bear runs away from you. I'm not convinced a brown bear is going to go as easy. This is Russia, too. I feel like bears in Russia... I don't know, bro. I don't think they play by the same rules over there. But I could be wrong. Okay, 100 and... 80 meters. To the outpost. Hopefully this thing's already, like, decked out. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh, this is nice. What is that little thing? Treehouse or something, maybe? All right, claim it. Let's go. <clears throat> now I can hop on the ATV. Oh, yeah, we're getting uh Okay. That's what I'm talking about. You have arrived. Our outposts are no five-star hotels. Yeah, no shit. But they beat sleeping outside. Once you fix the place, you can rest and resupply here anytime. Okay, so we got the buck, white-tailed deer, blue wildebeest, lesser kudu. I don't think we need that. I can't even do these. And now that you're comfortable, or as comfortable as anyone can be out here, I need you to help one of the other team members, Gunther Baden, at the campsite in Rybatsky Bay. You might have an easier time calling it Fisherman's Bay. We haven't heard from him since the blizzard last week. His last mobile communication said he was low on food, Gear up to hunt deer. Bring hungry Gunther some fresh meat. Yo, this scope is way better. I'm definitely... Wait, compatible items? 270, the Ranger 243. Oh, baby. I'm I'm putting that on for sure. Look at this. 12,000. Let's go ahead. Buy that. And then let's move into our actual inventory. Let's take our Gunther sights. Baden is our photographer. I tell you, he comes as highly recommended as you, but the truth is he comes very, very cheap. Gunther arrived about a week ago to set up remote cameras all across this region, okay. Ledinoi Bay. 
He loaded up an ATV with plenty of supplies, but like I said, we haven't heard from him since the storm. It's normal for people to disappear for a few days in the taiga. But Is that Andra, true, though? Unlike you, his resume grossly exaggerated his wilderness survival skills. He is more of a passionate amateur than a consummate professional. Thanks for hunting on his behalf. Bro, I know I just bought that scope. Why is it not in my thing? What is going on with the one by four? Or did I buy the wrong? Yeah. I own it. So give it to me. Keep forgetting I have to actually take the thing and put it in the thing. Okay, we're just going to put that on all of our guns because that site just seems a whole lot better. So let's throw that on there. Throw that on there. Okay. Now, what does that look like on the 30? Oh, baby. That thing is nuts. Okay, so we're supposed to find... What was she saying? Somebody's lost. Gunther Bodden is the photographer for the expedition. He set up a number of camps throughout the area. Okay. Elena hasn't heard from him in a week, but his last message said he was low on food. So our mission objectives is to hunt an animal. All right. I can totally do that. I did just hear... A moose which was right over this way I don't know do I have anything any of these lures uh, do they deer wildebeest lesser kudu lions roe deer coyotes I got nothing that attracts a moose I hear something walking close to me I'm trying to I think it's a lynx Honestly, the lynx is like the only animal that I have uh, a call for. I don't even remember if there's deer here. It's like the only calls. Oh, I got no moose, no bears. There's got to be some deer for sure, but I definitely heard something walking over here. I think that shit dipped though. Trying to play my injured rabbit call. But it ain't doing much. I got some red. Some red tracks over here. Oh, I guess maybe red is the one that I clicked on now. I don't know. They got to stop switching colors. Depending on the DLC. Lynx took a poop. But I do not hear the lynx anymore. I think I spooked his ass. Oh my god, I see a bear. Look at him. Holy. Traveling brown bear. Very easy. I mean, there's no way I'm hitting that shot, right? Imagine I hit that shot. Should I try to hit that shot? I got the scope for it, bitch. Tell me I won't. Right in the spawn. I can't hit it. Can't do it. That was definitely... That's a bear, though. He's walking. I didn't even see him. I was just surveying the land with my binoculars. That looks like a hunting blonde. And it just said, spot animal. It's another little something right there in the middle of the... Middle of the lake? I think this is a lake? On my map, it's shown as a water thing. Okay. Not seeing a lot else. Maybe we make our way towards that bear and just gun his ass, bro. I'm down. Oh, I see something else. What is that? Oh, it's the lynx. It's the lynx. Wait, I got a call for you. Shit. Oh, I'm a rabbit. I'm a hurt rabbit. He didn't even think about coming. What? Is it because I'm not close enough? I'm taking this shot. No, no, he's moving quicker. Oh my, come back, please. Seven. Honestly, I feel like if I just lay down 
right here, without a doubt, at some point, an animal is going to get curious. I say an animal. It's got to be the lynx. That's <laughs> that's the only thing that thing's attracting. What is that? Nothing. Okay, I'm gonna just I'm gonna just lay here and pretend I'm a rabbit. I'm just gonna follow this lynx because him and the bear were both going towards the same spot. So I feel like there might be a party I was not invited to, and I'd like to see what it's all about. I'm thinking my best strat. I got to go back to the normal strat, which is just walk normal, maybe even run. And then as soon as I get a warning call, boom, hit the duck. Lay down, get set up. Lure them in. That's what's been working for me the best. But until then, I'm just going to walk slowly. Try to look ahead. Make sure we're not running up too close on it. So I did get a warning telling me the lynx is a fickle fucker. Very quick to run away and hide. So I gotta make sure. Oh, what's that? Brown bear warning call? Dude. I wish, oh, oh shit, I see him. I see him. I'm about to 30-06 that motherfucker. <laughs> Bitch! In the heart. Is he? Did I break that motherfucker? Why is he yelling like that? What's good with those tracks right there? Are those the bear tracks? Shotgun. I got the shotgun out. Oh, that's definitely him. Okay, here we go. Yeah, now we're on him. This was him. Okay. Let's see if we hit a vital organ. Oh, dude, that's a lot of blood. That's a lot of blood. Vital organ hit. We might have just slayed us a brown bear. With the 30 out 6. I hope it's strong enough. I don't know. Oh, is that him? In the middle of the... Oh, shit. What is that? Oh, that's a rain. <laughs> it's a fucking reindeer. Wait. Is that the bear? Or is that a rock? Oh my god, that's the bear. Um. Let me at least see the reindeer, because. I mean, shit. If the reindeer's just. here. I might as well shoot it, right? I can't believe we slayed that bear. I don't know if I got it in the heart or what. That's like kind of what I was aiming for. Let's see if we can get this deer to come in. Let's see if I can hear it. Somebody's making fun of me in the comments the other day because I said I couldn't hear it, but I picked out the took out the binoculars to hear. I swear, whenever you stop moving and you aim your binoculars in a certain direction, you hear better in the game. Maybe I'm crazy, I don't know. But I'm pretty sure I hear footsteps louder when I'm looking in that direction through binoculars. Any Call of the Wild experts in the comments can set me straight on this. Not getting a lot of play from the reindeer. Feel like I might have scared him. Hell, I don't even know. Does that work on reindeer? The bleak collar, white tailed deer, black tailed deer, and mule deer. White tailed deer. 
I got nothing that works on a reindeer. I don't know. Maybe reindeers have white tails. It's possible. All I know is if I see one with a red nose, bro, no chance. I'm not killing them. Now I'm making all kinds of noise. Just a proper asshole. Y'all don't see that deer? I don't see that. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, that's the deer! Siberian musk deer. Wait, come back. Come back. I can't hit this shot. Oh, wait, it stopped. It stopped. Oh. Look at this. Oh, shit. Wait, wait, wait. Does this thing work on musk deer? Mule deer. Fuck. I gotta use the right gun for this. Which is the 243. Look at his happy ass running. Oh, don't do that. Please come back. I did not mean to scare you. If I hit this shot, I'm a god. Let me lay down. Y'all got faith in me? Hit him. I don't know if we got a vital organ though. Okay. Let's go claim our bear. Dude. That's crazy. He was shitting himself the whole way. Look at that. Last turd. Confirm the trophy. All right. Um, hit one. That was the proper ammo. Oh my God. I hit him in the left lung, or the right lung. That should feed Gunther for a while. If he's not grateful, I will smack him. Oh, so his heart is like right below... Huh, that's interesting. Okay. So the heart on the brown bear is right I'm under his I'm chin. I'm worried about Gunther. Even with all the trouble he's making for you and me, nobody deserves to starve or... Well, anyway, you'll find him at a campsite in the area I've marked on your hunter mate. Stay safe out there. How do you know I'll find him? You haven't heard from him in like a week. All right, let's see if we hit a vital organ on this deer, maybe. That was just a tough shot, man. Thing was running away from me. Did I shoot it all the way over here? I see the blood. That does not look like vital organ blood. Non-vital organ hit. That's unfortunate. Where did the damn tracks go? I don't even see them. Should it be the purple ones. Do y'all see purple tracks? Oh, here we go. Oh my god, we did kill it. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That must have been a decent shot. What did I hit? Oh! Hit him in the pelvis? Damn! I was trying to aim a little bit higher. I guess there was a lot of, uh, a lot of bullet drop there. Okay. Shot her in the ass. Guess I'll take that. Siberian musk deer. Alright. We leveled up. Okay, so the next mission, what does it say? Federal, oh, Taiga meetup. Travel to Gunther's camp. That's only 330 meters away? Oh, that's nothing. Objective complete, harvest a musk deer. Travel to the bay? I didn't even know these were objectives. Okay, traveling to Gunther's camp. Let's go. Bro, this is that same camp I was by earlier. I tried to walk into it and get in, but it wouldn't. What the fuck is that? Track animal call. That's another musk deer. Mating call? Said it came from that direction, but... Oh, 
Spot animal. Where? Oh. Oh. Salmon tracks. Could I hit this shot? I'm just gonna go out on a limb and say I can hit it. Don't hit the rock. Oh, I got that shot. Stop moving for one second, baby. I got that shot. Oh, fuck. That fucker is running. What is it doing? Still there, too. Oh, it's coming. Look at it starting to run. What? Please stop. I can't see. Damn! I'd have to be so. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that was an instant kill. Let's go. <laughs> High five, team. Bam. Got him. This game's awesome. I love guns. I gotta go hunting, I think. This is where Gunther was camping. Looks like he's all out of supplies. I told him, leave food uncovered in this wilderness. The bears will steal it. They're hungry this year. Take a look around for Gunther. People leave tracks like any other animals. Okay, now I'm hunting humans, I guess. I just got a lynx mating call. It would be cool to kill a lynx as well. Wait, was this a... Oh, no. Yeah, look at that. Right lung, liver, stomach. Perfect shot. That was good. Um, let me lay down real quick and see if I can get this lynx to come in. All right, that lynx is not interested in coming over here, apparently. I tried to just lay down and call it like 10 times, but didn't want to come. Okay. <clears throat> um, said it wanted me to track. Ah, got it. Bingo. There's Gunther. He must be out hunting. Is that Follow what he looks those like? Tracks. And be careful he doesn't shoot you by mistake. You're a dead shot. He's a dumb shot, okay? Bro, if he looks anything like that picture, I'm not going anywhere near that motherfucker. Wait, he's in the hunting blind? I don't see him. But okay, maybe. Dude looks like fucking Baphomet. Look at him. It actually would be kind of dope if that was part of the story. Well, wow, there is Gunther's place. hunting blind. But where is Gunther? I don't know. Taiga meetup. A kilometer away? Damn! I thought I was about to just okay. be walking right here. Enough of this wild moose chase. There is another campsite to the west. Gunther may have abandoned the last camp when the storm hit. If he's not there... The only other possibility is that he is lost in the tiger. I mean, that's no good. All right, well, let's uh, let's fast travel to the outpost, and then I can summon an ATV, and then we'll hightail it. I mean, it's only 500 meters away, but... Yeah, let's hightail it. Let's request that. Uh, bam. Like, where else are you going to use an ATV if not Siberia? By the way, has Columbus Nadel reached out? No. He's my American archaeologist friend, a major geek studying the history of Tiger Eagles. Nidal is not, shall we say, run like American archaeologists in the movies. Okay. But you are. So, lend my friend Nidal a hand when you can. Help him chronicle the rich history of this place before time erases it. Nidal is generous. He will reward your effort. Got it. I'm just, I'm ramping right now. I can't be deterred. Let's go. Get it up over that. That's what this thing is built for, baby. Oh. What the hell is this? This looks awesome. Oh, I thought that was a bear, but I guess it's not. Dude, this, this looks sick. All right. 
200 meters away to the camp. Imagine if it all just caved in and we fucking drowned. <laughs> awesome. Let's go. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Extreme ATV simulator. Just fucking. Ah! Can't see shit. <laughs> made it though. Still no Gunter. Now I'm getting worried about that Durak. Is there anything there that might tell us where he is? Uh, yeah, there is something actually. Um, Alina, I'm beginning to regret staying on this expedition. My hunter mate broke when I crashed my ATV. Then the storm came and came and came. I immediately feel bad for calling Gunter a Durak, even though he made some terribly foolish mistakes. Now he's sick and he's out there all alone, and who knows what he's getting up to. We need to find him. Hike for base camp. I don't know how far I'll make it on the taiga. If you find this note and I am not already safe and warm at base camp with a belly full of reindeer stew, please send that help. That sounds like a reindeer, but it's, it's in pain. Oh no. Gunther was sick, starving, and a terrible shot. What if he wounded an animal without killing it? Or left a trap on the wrong trail? Please. Find this reindeer and tell me I'm wrong. First, I just gotta move this shit. Track animal call. Okay. Is the reindeer close? I got my shotgun out just in case. You know how it is. Oh! There it is. Found it. Reindeer are sacred to Leonard's. Seeing them wounded like this breaks my heart. Yeah. You want me to kill it or what? I think she wants me to kill it. That that should do the job. Oh shit, I shot it with a 30 out 6. I meant to use my other rifle. I just forgot. Just destroyed that thing. Definitely wasn't in pain after that though. That oh my goodness. Middle neck. That reindeer won't suffer anymore. No. Thank you. So the I heart. I have to report the incident to the state veterinary and phytosanitary service. The local director, Dimi Pushkin, asked for your info, and being a state representative, I had to give it to him. Dimi may hit you up for jobs from time to time. Okay. I don't want you to get distracted, but keeping the state happy makes life easier for our expedition. So don't ignore him. Got it. I only got a 16 reward for that. That was no good. I used the wrong ammo and I did not hit a vital organ. Scenic weather number one. Okay, I think that's a good spot to end our first episode. That's not conclusive. Let's see what but she if says. Is out there with a firearm, we have to find him before more animals get hurt or before he hurts himself. Do you see anything around his campsite that would give us a lead? I got nothing, lady. All right, everybody. That's going to do it for this episode of The Hunter Call of the Wild. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Thank you for supporting the series. Thank you for supporting the channel. I do appreciate it. And I will catch you guys right back here in the next video. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like if you didn't just refresh it and give it one more chance. And as always, guys, I don't really have